Welcome back into Victoria's Tarot. Today we are going to do a Sebastian Rogers Rewind. I know y'all, we all thought he would be found by now, but this is what happens when you have grown ass people playing childish games when you're actually looking for a child. So we're going to do a Sebastian Rewind. And we're going to start with Katie's energy, the night Sebastian <sighs> disappeared. What's going on with Katie's energy, the night Sebastian Rogers disappeared? Because I refuse to say he ran away. If he ran away, he was trying to run from her ass, in my opinion. Unless he was running from Chris, and there's something you're not telling us, Katie and Popo. Queen of Cups. Needy, over-emotional. So it looks like Katie was in her feelings that night, like always. The world in the reverse, that tells us about a need for closure. Something not being completed. What's not seen, the hierophant. This talks about traditional values, church, a teacher, things like that. Marriage. Something not seen about her marriage. So in the past, she's in her feelings about whatever she's in her feelings about. In the present, there's a need for closure. Something's not completed, was not seen. I feel like there's something going on in her marriage. When it comes to Sebastian, we have mental illness and learning to, how to cope with the situation. Knight of Swords in the reverse. This is like a very aggressive, violent energy. We have the High Priestess in the upright, which tells us about secret knowledge. So I feel like whatever this is here, this is the environment surrounding the situation. We're going off Katie's energy and surrounding her feeling so needy and being over emotional. There's something violent. Is she saying something violent? Is she doing something violent? It's violent. And then there's the tower moment for the outcome. A sudden change. So let's get some clarity into these messages for Katie's energy. The night Sebastian disappeared. Worry, anxiety, fear, the upright mental illness. I'm going to go. So back at this line of sports. What is it that you were trying to cope with, Katie? What is it that was like driving your ass bananas because this night is it's showing that you weren't in your right your right way you were like in your bag with your emotions queen of pentacles jealousy huh queen of pentacles this could be work or home conflict this could be a selfish or a jealous woman so who are you jealous of you say you were on the phone with chris for about three hours or you guys on the phone arguing we have the Page of Swords, which tells us about curiosity, chatty. You said you were on the phone, and you're looking for closure. What kind of closure are you looking for? Temperance in the upright tells us about the balance, the peace, the harmony, blending. The lovers in the upright needing to make a choice. So it's looking like... You guys were probably on the phone all that time, in my opinion, trying to figure out if you guys were going to stay together or not. That's what it's looking like. Trying to find peace, bring peace to the marriage, but it wasn't working. And instead of this being Sebastian's energy is coming up under, is on top of you guys, the lovers, you know, needing to make a choice. Queen of Swords in the reverse, she's very nasty. So whatever she's saying, it's very nasty. Secret knowledge about the star. The tower moment being clarified by the nine of wands in the reverse, which tells us about the end of a battle. 
So what is really good, Katie, the night your son disappeared? The only thing that you keep pushing out is how you're feeling in your marriage. Did you take your son's life to save your marriage? That's what I have right now. Like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys on the next video.